Good evening, YouTubers. New Time Travel Jaime ADA here, and welcome back to my YouTube video vlog for Friday night, June 10th, 2016. Well, what a day that was today. And today we was went to the movies, but found out that that the movie got into a film break. That was Captain America's Civil War. My gosh. Anyway, that's why uh, they had to send the other movie to get it fixed. Because this has never happened before. Because back in 2012, we went to see, um, actually it's 2011, Harry Potter and Deathly Hallows Part 2. And we was in a, something, something in the middle of it. Then the film started to deteriorate and the film starts to break. Now, anyway, well, I did check on YouTube and someone uploaded the Super Super 8 on YouTube and the film break and they start and they filmed and uploaded the film breaks. This never happened before. Um, I know when it, the film break happens many times, like on a Mystery Science Theater 3000, a movie, uh, the film, bre the film breaks <laughs> during the um, Commander Cody, and then it happens again at Mystery Science Theater 3000, a movie, the film breaks during this island Earth. <laughs> oh yeah, so darn funny. But anyway, um... Even though, have you ever experienced when you went to the movie and a film start to break? Just let me know in the comments below. Anyway, um, as what I'm saying here, um, many of the last time we went to the movies. The first one we went to see is the Flintstones Round Night Tonight 4. And then we were so little and uh, we would try to escape the theater, but my mom got told me, said, no, you cannot escape the movie. <laughs> so anyway, we, we went to the mall and we got some DVDs. Plus, I might go back to the Goodwill Thrift Store because they're having a the 50% off tomorrow. Probably got to Sneak some for more VHS tapes. So anyway, I'm still hunting for some brand new VHS tapes to show you guys to upload my VHS and DVD pickup video. I wish I could hunt some more, but anyway, the last time was I was at the thrift store, I was trying to find the Indiana Jones trilogy, the 1999 THX um, cut in widescreen but unfortunately we search and we search they don't have it because it must be all gone sold out I was kind of very disappointed too because my three Indiana Jones tapes from VHS from 1999 they all damaged and um yeah they all damaged and it's it played through but it's kind of got all the lines because the tape we got those tapes a long time ago, around 2000 to 2001 because the, the film started worn off but anyway if you have somebody that owns a Indi another Indiana Jones trilogy box set like letterbox let me know if you have one let me know or I can search it up on eBay or Listeria, not Lista, because it got me a hard time. So I'm probably going to eBay or go to my collector's online web store and find one. Mm -hmm. um, as what I'm saying here, um, my brother, he's at my number room watching the new Yankee workshop with Norm Abram. My God, this show 
It's been on PBS since 1989. It's a very good how to do series. And I was trying to look for it on, on demand, but they don't have none. So I'm glad I finally got came across all 20 seasons on YouTube. And you can find it on website newyankeeworkshop.com. Um, some of the episodes has been taken down because of copyright infringement with the New Yankee Workshop doc, New Yankee.com and WGBH Boston. Um, anyway, for those of you guys who, who already brought the new Star Trek Tudor at the Con Director's Car on Blu-ray, you might notice some problems because Commander Sulu was looking back at the chair twice so that's a framing issue hopefully uh, Paramount had to correct the film so anyway um, I can't wait to go see Ghostbusters the original 1984 oh yes this is the Ghostbusters that I grew up with yep Bill Mary Dan Aykroyd and a fun fact um, the reason why they shut down, they're not going to do Ghostbusters 3 because it was originally going to do for Ghostbusters 3, but sadly, the recent passing of actor Harold Ramis died in 2014, um, the production scrap. And then, before that, Bill Murray has sent, they sent the script to, Bear, to Bill Murray, and then, unfortunately, Bill Murray had to sh had shred the scripts, tear the paper up, saying, and Bill Murray quote say, nobody wants to see um, people in, no one to see um, old folks in Ghostbusters 3. Older folks, like middle age or something like that. Um, hmm. Anyway, so instead, they tried to reboot it, Ghostbusters, with the all-new female version of it. But I does seen the trailer of it. But I know I don't know because got a lot of people got negative reviews of the all-female Ghostbusters universe. Hmm. Even though the film's not open yet, but should I go see the reboot or the original 1984? Comment below. <laughs> so, um, my friend Renee, um, she was not feeling well yesterday. I did talk to her, and she noticed that what's wrong with my toy. Well, if you go back to my Wednesday's vlog video, you see that my old 2003 Enterprise A got the, um, the yellowing on it, the, the cane. Let me show. It goes like this. Let me grab it real quick here. You see right here. That's the um, see. That's the aging of the yellowing. So I did point out to uh, now Soundwave Dave 08 pointed out that the the reason why this is yellowing because it's a chemical reaction to the plastic and. Um, Hopefully, I did watch this tutorial on how to repair his toy with Transformers. So, I'm probably going now to like a department store or beauty salon to get a peroxide cream so I can put it on the, the, um, apply that to the, um, the paint. So, I don't want to ruin the, um, the registry numbers. If not, if the prox, then... I'm not sure my lamp has a UV ray on there, but to question to sound day, sound wave day 08, where can I find the UV ray lamps at? Let me know in the comments below. So anyway, this is close. This is getting retirement soon because I already brought the new version of the Enterprise A, and I'm so happy I got it in my collection here it's a very good toy and it's a how-to and I haven't built any Star Trek model kits in a long while the last one I did was in 2012 if you guys remember it 
on my old YouTube channel, Time Travel Jaime 88. I broke the pie lines on there. Um, I did point out that I was going to use some kind of spray paint, the decal spray, but unfortunately, uh, just point out by SteveTheFish.net because if I do use that kind of thing, it'll make the Enterprise yellow. So anyway, um, I don't know how to do this, but if I I can wait till the springtime, so I can um, no, act, not summertime, but in the fall, so so I can start building my ships. Um, I know I'm not good at lighting up model kits, but I've seen videos of. Helping people with one person, another person helping with the Star Trek model kit with the lightings and whatnot. Let's not probably do the same thing too. Oh, 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 oh. Excuse me, sorry folks. I am so tired because it's almost because past at eleven o'clock, and you can see my battery is almost about to die here. So um, on my camera. So anyway. Hope you guys enjoy it as much as fun as I did too. Oh yeah, that would be great. Um, now as you probably know, that boxing legend Muhammad Ali passed away from at the long battle with Parkinson disease, and he also died of natural causes. He was like he was 74 years old, actually 77. I could be wrong, but anyway, it's a great models. Sylvester Stallone says Muhammad Ali is like the real Apollo Creed. It's like a stun like a butterfly, a sting like a bee. That's a quote right here from Muhammad Ali. So anyway, hope you enjoy it. Um, I gotta go to bed. I uh, upload a. Um, oh, 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 I'm so young. Excuse me. Sorry about that, folks. Um, I upload it. Go to sleep. Get up in the morning. If you want to shout out my next video, comment below and tell me what are you going to do for the last day of school. Till next time, New Time Travel Jaime 88 saying good night and have a pleasant tomorrow.